Jerry Jones might have simply been asking too much for Tony Romo and the market didn't respond accordingly, which is probably what led to the CBS decision. According to Bleacher Report's Mike Freeman, one NFL exec told him Jerry was asking for a first round pick in exchange for Romo and teams were like, no way in hell. But the narrative going around NFL front offices, according to Freeman, is that Tony Romo will definitely make a comeback because finding a good quarterback is hard. Teams still want him, they just didn't want to trade a high draft pick for him. Romo is part of the 2017 CBS broadcasting team, but as of June 1st, he will no longer be contractually obligated to the Cowboys, so he could presumably do commentary for a year and then sign with another team next season. But here is why I wouldn't bet on it. By the 2018 season, Romo will be 38 years old and four seasons removed from his last full healthy season. By then, no team in the league will expect vintage Tony Romo to return. Plus, Romo has a history of showing up to training camp out of shape. He'll settle into his cushy job, realize he has job security, and more importantly, relevance for decades. And if he doesn't return the season after next, he gets to announce the Super Bowl. So unless Romo really sucks on the air and CBS boots him for Peyton Manning, there's no reason to expect Tony Romo to play another game in the NFL.